Let's move on. All right. We got next up. Neeners. Nina. Nina's cool. I don't know a ton about the character, but I guess we're going to learn on the way there. Let's see how many changes she got. She's the one. She feels like a character that would have gotten a bajillion changes. Yoshimitsu. Nita Williams. Uh, let me change the the, the change list on your guys' screen as well. There you go. Nita. All right, cool. Uh, let me make a tweet real quick, actually. On to Nina. Honestly, uh, Miguel took me longer than I thought. He's pretty cool. I think uh, he, he seems like a lot of fun. He seems like a character that seems more like my style now. I like the old Nina costume. I made it blue because it's more it's uh, more my style. But other than that. DLC characters I'm going to be doing on a different date. So I think uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend maybe after SCR, I'm going to I'm gonna start streaming me learning Anna. Anna. I have to learn to pronounce it Anna because it's two N's. Um, I'm going to learn my, I'm going to uh, stream myself learning Anna. And that way you sort of guys get an idea how I break down characters and stuff like that. And then we'll see afterwards. I think that what I'm going to do is Anna after SCR. Uh, I'm planning on maybe doing a stream for the BB tag patch too, because uh, I do commentate quite a bit of BB tag. Uh, but for Tekken specifically, I'll probably be doing more more than not. I'll be doing Tekken on this stream. There's a couple other things I have, but I want to learn Anna. She looks like a lot of fun. Yeah, uh, sure. Uh, um, be easy to ask Fergus, right? The dude streams quite a bit. Um. So, yeah, let's get into this one. Anna changes. One for 17 damage, negative uh, four on block, plus one hit. They've buffed a lot of 10 frame punishes. They've buffed a ton of 10 frame punishes. This is uh, a more in line with that, right? So uh, I think this is good. I think the overall 10 frame punish buff is good because a lot of people were sort of outclassed in the 10 frame punish business. Uh, this doing 24 instead of 22 is actually a big buff. Actually a pretty big buff, so I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, uh, what else? Moving on forward. Uh, 214. Now screws on counter hit. No, 214. Also, why are you face down? I need to get a pillow behind me. I'm slouching too much. I've been streaming so much and sitting in chairs because I've been fucking either playing or studying that it's been rough. I think Jin's remains the dominant 10 frame punish. You're right. And uh, with the out of it, uh, with the change of Gigas's being launch punishable because it's negative 17 now, it probably is between Jin and Josie on best 10 frame punishes. Uh, I think I give it to Jin though because his is fucked up. 30 damage knockdown, 10 frame punish. That's safe on block. That's fair. Uh, stop laying on the ground, lady. It's dirty on there. Don't want to mess up your. So, all right, screws on counter hit. Does the whole thing counter? Hit? Yes, it does. Counter hit Fisher. So, uh, four two four two one. You can counter. You can hit confirm this. It's still wall sprouts, probably. You can hit confirm this though. Uh, that's scary. Uh, not a regular hit. So just on counter hit. 
Uh, probably in the air, though. Yeah, still uh, air screws. But now screws on on um, normal on hit on the ground. So this is very hit confirmable. If I if I do two one, because the thing is that the second hit doesn't hit confirm anyway. So if I'm trying to do this whole thing and I'm trying to hit confirm it, if it counter hits, I can see this. But it'll take a bit of work. Let's see, if I do... Can you do like random block? Random guard, yeah. Yeah, this is not too hard. Is, on top of which, if you have headphones, this is mega easy. Yeah, this is mega easy if you have headphones on. Just listen to it. Hey, Spider Lord, how's it going? There's a lot of things you can do. If you if you actually play with headphones on, there's a lot of tricks you can do like that. Where if you're just listening for it, you can just do things like this. Where you're listening to it. Oh, she's probably in, in still. Yeah, stuff like that. You can you can learn how to do that. Uh, headphones really help for those situations. A lot of you can you react faster to hearing than you do to sight, and you're also looking for a bunch of things. So then when you try to like listen to something specific, then you'll be able to hit confirm it a lot easier. You just gotta get good at it. Either way, something to practice uh, if you're if you have something like that. Active frames increase by uh, two. On that, uh, this is probably to make it a little bit easier to use, but I don't see I don't see a big reason. Uh, probably actually it's probably to get this to hit more consistently. It's probably a consistency thing. I uh, I were to bet you if anything, but cool. That is what it is. Down forward one plus two. Double slaps. Screw down mid air hit. Cool. Extra screw that she has. Essen essentially a one hit screw. Alright, uh, reach increased. Oops, 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 oops. Reach increased forward movement after, uh, forward movement after move increased so opponent is closer. Now you're closer in that situation. And you're knocked down afterwards. Uh, what is this on block? Since it's a low high it, in that it doesn't, um, it doesn't jail you out of the low when you when you get the or when you get the low blocked. So what is it altogether? Down to three, right? Down to three. That's negative six four on block. So uh not not bad. Because you're able to do this and then do stuff like that. This is this is uh really tricky. It just means that you're gonna hit more people more consistently. Right. Stuff like that. Tricky tricky stuff. Hope you're whoever. Okay, cool. Never mind. Back one. Negative sixty on block. You see this a ton. This is a the online special. I don't know how to call. I don't. I haven't played Nina like more than twice, so I'm not sure of your combos. But um, yeah, you see this quite a bit. Opponent closer on block, so easier to punish. This is easy down for two range for a lot of characters. So, pretty good. Um, essentially, essentially what they did 
is that they've actually made uh, uh, they've actually nerfed it, even though they made it negative 16 on block. There are one or two characters that won't be able to punish it, but for the most part, a lot of characters will. Uh, like uh, Bob, Bob won't be able to get a. Oh, that's her back one plus two. He won't be able to get down back one plus two on this anymore. He has to settle for forward four, uh, forward one plus two, up forward one plus two, one plus two. So that's a nerf for him. I have to go back. I have to look at all the things that got nerfed in that way where they're now like negative 17 or 16. Because uh, it used to be before that a lot of moves got nerfed like that. So uh, Bob might have gotten a little bit worse in that way. He might have to settle for up forward. 1 plus 2, 1 plus 2. Back to 2, 2. Ugh, the main of my existence. Counter hit reaction was changed. Okay. Boy. What was it before? I could have sworn it was the same thing. Was it just a knockdown? For some reason, it's not that good. I just swing into it because I'm an idiot. Oh, it was a... Uh, what's it called? Keel over state. Card state. That's crazy. So if you uh, two two two, you do two 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 guard cancel, or you do two two up um, two two two, you cancel it like two two two, like this. There's a lot of things to do with this. Now, if you try to swing into it, trying to stuff her out, you will get counter hit and full punished. So that's good. Back three. Damage changed to ten. What was this move? What was it on? Um, on regular hit six negative six really needed a change to be uh less damage do you get something after this now reaction change on hit oh maybe oh you get a four four three afterwards that's crazy look at this And considering that's a, it's a mid high, so it's, but you can fish with it still. That's crazy. So this does 36 damage. Very cool. No, uh, not 36. Sorry, I'm stupid. Uh, what's it called? Uh, 46, 46, 46 damage. That's very good. It's got buffed. 443 changed to 24 damage. Hey, look at that. They both got buffed. So this whole sequence got buffed. That got buffed too then. Man, I'm, how did I do this the first time and I've fucked it up every time since? There you go. Ah. What else? Uh, 441 plus 2 changed to negative 5 on block. Blonde Bomb. Blonde Bomb. Wait, what? Her wall bounce is safe on block? They made Blonde Bomb safe on block? Hello? I wonder if that also wall bounces. No, it doesn't. Okay, so that's still very good in that way. That's fucked up. Why is this safe? This is safe. I'm standing in range here. Hey, what's up? You know, go for these lows here, and then boom. Wait, that didn't. Uh, that didn't. Oh, four, four, one plus two. There you go. Does it still hit grammar? Say yeah, safe armor move. Uh, does it still hit grounded? Let me see. Ah, uh, see if I can get this end time. Yes, it does. It still hits grounded. <sighs> oh, 
Oh, baby. And you can charge it. And you can charge it. That's crazy. Look at this. Fucking crazy. All right. Closer on a hit? We're a quarter four to one. So if you get a launch. I can't do these, but you can get it. You can. These are easier to hit now. You can get a couple of these in a row. Jubilar, how you going, man? How you doing? Safe wall bounce move that hits grounded. Okie city, baby. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Absolutely right. Yeah, these are easier to hit now. Cool. Uh, you might see some more stylish combos out of people. Her, essentially, this is her thruster. Uh, Paul has something very similar to this. Maybe able to do something like this. Yeah, you're able to sleek him in now. Cool. Might be able to do stuff with that. Like, able to put like two thrusters in in that way. Quarter four, three. Love this move. Look at that. Oh, what a great move. Increase active frames increased by two. So this is even better from this range, right? If you're able to hit it, there you go. Boom. Easier move. You can already do three of them in a combo. Yeah, right? But I'm just not good. Like, I can't I can't do that consistently. I might be able to do it. Hold on. I'm not that good. Hey! <laughs> you can do four now. Well, I did it once. You saw it. You saw it. You saw it, right? You saw it. It's like that kid that hit that weird shot. Like, he threw it behind his back in the parking lot. He just goes, he takes it and throws it behind his back like a party lot. And he fucking hits the backboard. And you're like... Or he goes in, you're like, do you guys see that? Do you guys see that? I did it. I totally did it. See if you saw it, right? Man, I had the rhythm. It'll never happen again. It'll never happen again. <laughs> oh, I believed. I believed in myself, which is crazy. That's fucking crazy. And there's people much better than me. They can do that for sure. So two seems like it's very possible. Like you can just do. I don't know what to do. Like you might be able to do more combos out of three straight. If you don't do them perfectly. That's what my thought is that if you don't do them perfectly, it's it's a little bit easier. Wire rising one one plus two. Got changed uh f first damage, uh first hit of wall standing one uh one plus two got changed to have more damage. But the um but the second hit got changed or scaled. So scaling was moved so that the first hit does more damage. Uh, this is a buff to the, uh, what's it called? To, uh, what's it, this. See. So yeah. Now I'm trying not to get thrusters. Jesus Christ. Yeah, either way, you can get more. Th this, uh, the while sitting one combo does more damage now. Either way. So that's good. 
Uh, this does more damage, so people who actually spend the time in learning this combo and doing its hard execution uh, get rewarded for it a little bit more. Which is worth... I, I want people to be rewarded for their execution. Approach enemy, quarter forward, one plus two. Oh, uh, one of our starter for chain throw, uh, hitbox expanded downwards, so people can't naturally or uh, accidentally duck it for no reason. Hitbox expanded downwards for the same reason. Uh, her other chain throw. Oof. Cool. Nina got buffed. This is insane. Why wouldn't I just throw this out? I'm not even in crouching afterwards. That's fucking crazy. This is crazy. Nina got buff. Nina got buff. That's crazy, man. Oh, I didn't show the last couple changes. My bad. I fucking completely forgot. So, uh, yeah, wall balance on hit. Thruster now closer. We were we were showing that. All right. Uh, quarter four three. Uh. Tsh. Active frames increased. If I hit it. Almost. But yeah. Yo, Jubilar, thank you for the follow, man. I appreciate it a lot. I mean, it means a lot. Uh, just because. Just starting out, you know. It's, uh, it's nice to have people around and to talk to. So, thank you, man. I appreciate it. So, I think Nina players have a lot to practice. I think Nina players have a lot to work with. This is why Victim was really happy. I think Nina got a lot better. Not a lot. She got slightly better. Slightly better. But she, this could be have uh, this could have crazy ramifications. If she gets more damage off this of her um, wall carry combos, she might be getting rewarded more as she goes along. As well as this being scary. This being a great Fisher, right? You're standing in this range. Boom. 443 getting buffed. So even stuff like wipe the floor got buffed, right? That's crazy. I thought when I saw this 443 buff, I definitely thought wipe the floor was getting damage nerfed. Or it's gonna be it was gonna be scarier on block. But now I I think she just got better. That's crazy. Nina got way better. Not way better. I keep saying that. I'm just really impressed. Like I think all things put together. It could be scary. Wall rising three went from started from 18 to 13. I missed that change. Holy shit. Does she have anything out of her uh, wall standing three? Wall standing three. No, she doesn't. But it means that it is not only a uh, plus two on hit move. It's still negative 13. But if you see... see see someone uh get up and they're not supposed to you're able to do something about it right so 13 frames it's uh it gives her a punish 13 frame punish from uh from crouching that isn't this well i guess this is 13 frames right and stuff like that so it's not really it's not really that big of a buff uh, it's faster i guess one of the things it's like it's something it's just not slow, like which is crazy. Like for a move that's negative thirteen and plus two, it's like it would be it, it, the fact that it would be eighteen frames is actually insane. Like it hasn't, it have zero reason to exist. Now it has a slight reason to exist because it's fast. So pretty, pretty cool. I'm a big, I'm a big fan of that actually. Um, all things like this is these are changes that clean up a character. But uh. Blonde bomb. Oh shit! And you have thruster buff too. You go blonde bomb into thruster, thruster into a wall combo. That's fucking crazy. Here, let's. I'm not gonna hit it. Whoo, baby. Oh, that's probably why they buffed it actually. Not for her combos, but rather so that she can get that pretty easily, and not worry too much about what where. If you do it like straight on the wall. If you're like right here, right? Yeah, that's exactly why they changed it so that she can thrust her people onto the wall. Uh, 
Oof. That's uh, that's really good. That's really, really good. I think Nina got scary. So uh, you have to think about it this way. Um, essentially, what happens what when you give a character a good wall bounce move is that they make the stages smaller. Now, instead of this stage being 24 by 24, the stage is essentially 21 by 21. Because at any time she gets you in this range right here, or 20 by 20. Because essentially, when she gets you in this range right here, she is now in wall bounce territory. You have to worry about the low mid mix up because if you're sitting in this range right here this is either a uh if you hit it right a slide mix up let me push her out just a little bit so she can be at where i want her to be right there you're either in a slide mix up from here let's fix the car uh, or you're in a wall bounce mix up well she should have been closer but that's the point um let me reset it so that it can show exactly where it is. Because uh, through some testing, I've discovered that wall bounces are about from here. So if you get someone to bounce from here, about three units away, you get the wall bounce. So now you have a straight mix up. If you have a safe, if you have a safe mid, this becomes a scary mix up. So now you're worried in this range right here, and now you're sitting here, and now you're having mix ups. So essentially, what a safe, uh, a safe wall bounce move is it makes the stage smaller for her this is scary for a character like nina because she already has scary wall a uh, wall game so if she's putting you on the wall from this range now and you're thinking about a low mid mix up you're now afraid you should be afraid so her stages get smaller uh characters that can also do that are like characters like geese geese makes the stage a lot smaller uh but it's a little bit different uh, because he has to hit a combo for it and he doesn't really sort of get a mix up or he doesn't put a mix up on you for that he sort of because his he's a special mid uh fang fang also does this as well fang uh king does this to a certain extent and I'm trying to think of other really good wall bounce moves that do this oscar oscar can do this too Asuka has a, a down forward. She can do uh, back to back to cancel into full crouch two mix up or full crouch three down forward three mix up and full crouch down forward three wall bounces full crouch down forward two on counter hit gives you a full launch combo. So either way, you're really fucked. You almost want to just take the hit on the low and just eat the mix up afterwards, but it, it puts you it puts you in the same mix up. Getting hit by a down a full crouch down forward two puts you in the exact same mix up uh, over again. And it's not a situation you want to be in. So uh, characters like that can really make you really fuck you up now.